Now let's summarize what we studied today. Today our lesson was on selective breeding, species and selective breeding. When we say species, we're talking about a group of similar organisms that can breed with one another to produce fertile offsprings. Okay, now they produce fertile offsprings all the time. Their young ones are always fertile. Now when different species produce, reproduce, if you are lucky enough, you are going to get fertile offsprings, but mostly the offsprings are infertile. Okay, so different species that can reproduce often produce infertile offsprings. And remember that before different species can reproduce, they must be similar in some way. Okay, now you are not going to see a snake reproducing with a bed. Okay, but you, you can see a cow and then a yak reproducing because they are similar. Mm -hmm. Certain different species can produce fertile offsprings. And then an example is a liger. Now, desired characteristics can be selected and then enhanced in selective breeding. We study the steps of selective breeding. Where we are going to select organisms showing the desired characteristics. We ensure that they breed to produce offsprings. We select the offsprings with that characteristic and then ensure that they also breed. Until we get to a point where the offsprings, all the offsprings are showing the desired characteristics.